In this video, I made five champs disable their lean and sprint keys and face off against five golds. Will the handicap against the champs be enough for the golds to win, or will the champs be unaffected? Let me know your predictions down in the comments. All right, here we are. We're going to be starting here on coastline and just to quickly go over the rules. So none of the champs can sprint, as you can see, and none of them can lean. They have the uh, keys completely unbound, so they won't be able to do either of that. Now, the golds, on the other hand, as you can see, can sprint and lean. So we're going to see if this is enough to give the golds enough of an advantage to actually win over the champs. So far, not much has really happened just yet. But as I say that, Ugi with the first kill of the game onto Death Dealer, that's going to be your Jaeger getting taken out now. To, or Ugi able to get a kill somehow from Kitchen. Croc actually walking all the way up the VIP hallway, doing the rush that I used to do so much. And he's going to get a kill onto Blessed. But Return's going to get another kill onto Atheist. That's going to be your Oryx going down. So now it's all up to Kicks inside of hall of fame as well as na who's downstairs in office right now returns with the bomb flicking onto his teammate he's going to be killing tubi the tubi goes down they're gonna to have to revive him now ugi taking some damage from vip that's going to be kicks he's rotated in here from penthouse now ugi gonna pick up his teammate now na trying to push up through cool vibes but he's gonna get swiftly taken out by v so it's all up to kicks now inside of hall of fame he's rotating now into penthouse None of the attackers seem to know his exact positioning so far. Returns with the bomb still has yet to plant. It's been quite a while now. Kicks just biding his time inside of theater right now. Going out to swing Ugi. Going to take a little bit of damage to the wall as he's going to hit the deck now. Ugi with the pistol out of ammo, but Tubi able to come in from behind and take him out. Round number one goes to the champ players. All the champs now slow walking out of spawn. It uh, must suck to have to walk all the way from one part of the map to the other. No sprinting is really a hassle, I'd imagine. Returns taking a lot of damage from Death Dealer right now, who is inside of Blue Bar. Death Dealer really locked himself in quite the pickle. Returns just trying to watch his cross now. V trying to peek in and take him out. But wow, actually a rotate here into Sunrise is going to allow Death Dealer to escape with that kill onto V. Now Returns trying to go for the nade. That's going to bounce off and surely miss now. Croc trying to push by service. He's going to get a kill onto Na, but he's going to have to go through Blessed, who's sitting right here ready for this. Death Dealer actually going to get a team kill onto Atheist, and somehow Croc able to win that. No reaction time coming out from Blessed now. All up to Death Dealer inside of Sunrise, as well as Kicks inside of Blue Bar now. Returns still holding the Blue Bar window now, but it looks like Death Dealer was able to escape just underneath his line of sight. Kicks now as well inside of blue bar gonna swing gonna try to take out croc a little bit of lag here it seems but croc gonna take him out somehow and croc now flanking the castle of death dealer who's gonna take him out but be not before returns able to hop in the window and get the final frag all right so the champs are saying that the game has just been too easy so they're giving themselves challenges they're turning off their sound and 2b has put his brightness to zero but v is going to grab a kill onto death dealer ugi with a kill onto kicks now ugi somehow just in sight doing a lot of damage onto jaeger but not going to be taking out ash that is croc going down now ugi have to fall out of the bathroom area as he is getting completely swamped right now not going to get flashed by those flashbangs atheist is going to be taken out by v and ugi with the last kill 3-0 now for the champ players and it seems like it's just too easy for him. All right, Death Dealer gonna try to go for an Amara rush right now, which this could actually work is the champ players have now turned their audio off. So they're on 0% brightness, no leans, no sprints, no audio. So they basically can't see or hear, nor can they lean or sprint. So they're in a terrible spot right now. And it seems like it hasn't really halted them whatsoever. But as I say that Death Dealer gonna get a kill onto Tubi before Ugi is able to refrag. He's gonna be taking some damage from Bless though who's inside of VIP. Croc going to team kill onto Ugi. Lots of team kills coming out from here. And now with finally getting a kill onto return. So this looks like the golds are turning things around a little bit. Maybe the champs actually gave themselves a big enough crutch. Kicks with the kill onto Croc now. So there goes your Malusi player. V, the only one left on the champ team now. Not even able to hear the player behind him. And he was on a controller. Finally going to take him out now. The gold's winning their first round here. 
right it's been quite a minute now but finally death dealer is going to be entering the building and both these champs don't even know where he's at because they can't even hear him coming v's gonna go down as well as croc now two big kills for death but looks like oogie is pushing up the cool vibe stairs right now and he's trying to do his best to stop death dealer from pushing in the flash is going to come out on that blitz though but death dealer runs out of ammo the melee comes out and takes oogie out so it's all up to returns and tubi now c4 coming out from tubi that's going to miss returns with some shots on from the black balcony he's going to take out ace and they have the bomb now as well the golds are throwing with that ace jumping over the balcony like that athe is going to be taken down from tubi who's climbed up now from cool vibes into kuka returns trying to do his best to combat this blitz but he can't sprint away because the sprint keys are unbound and that's going to be death dealer taking out returns but tubi with the second kill on the kicks he's in a 1v2 now death dealer is only one hp coming up the cool vibe stairs at the moment with blessed so both players are coming from the same direction but tubi doesn't have any audio so he may not know that finally going to see that blessed is on the cool vibe stairs but blessed is going to take him out good shot by him that's the second round going to the golds all right so we've got another rush lineup coming out from the gold players now we've got death dealer here on that blitz we've got blessed on the ying so we'll see what they make of this not much as ugi's gonna walk straight to the front door and just take out death dealer on that blitz while he's trying to melee the door open and returns with another kill as well onto nah that's going to be your ace being taken out plus now trying to refrag i'm not even really sure what he's doing he's having atheist drone ahead of him right now that floor is going to go out and be a slight annoyance but i'm sure that's all it'll be oogie on the front door right now trying to get some shots off to bless but croc gonna take out kicks now athe is still trying to drone in with the flores drones blessed inside of or outside the lamborghini doorway here trying to get a kill on to oogie but it's just not happening for him so far returns trying to get the kill onto atheist and that's exactly what he's going to do now it's all up to blessed in the 1v5 clutch but he's going to get taken out as well flawless round from the champ players finally had enough of losing and they're going to take map number one four to two oogie now with the first kill onto blessed that's going to be your smoke getting taken out to be invert repel now on the big window trying to get some angles here into piano but that's actually just going to be croc shooting him all the way from piano v going to get taken out by atheist now that is i believe two kills for him onto uki and v now he's going for his third onto croc who's just on the window here croc with no audio uh, i don't believe he is even going to know that atheist was so close onto the window there now returns is slowly pushing up into astro right now but that's exactly where death is at the vault over the stairs and the swing coming out but it's still going to be returned somehow getting that kill to be on the big window still trying to get those picks i believe he got one onto atheist now returns trying to push into bathroom that is where the bomb is someone is prone on the rotate that is going to be nah for some reason just prone on the rotate hole kicks trying to push now into bathroom both of the champs are low hp and they don't have any sound for when things like this happen when bandit chooses to swing out and kill returns leaving Tubi in a 1v2 clutch now with low hp a minute and 20 seconds left so Tubi has time to clutch this out but is he going to use the time efficiently enough kicks and nod nah just playing very passive right now inside of the bomb site to be not able to get any picks is going to end up leaving this repel probably going to push up through asher stairs from trophy window exactly what Tubi is doing now 50 seconds left on the clock so he's wasted a little bit of his time but not is all the way inside of library hall at the moment leaving kicks on site all by himself to face up against Tubi, who's currently walking up the solar stairs and is going to get that first kill the bandit is taken out now it's not nah versus Tubi. they have about the same hp Tubi might have just a little bit more but Tubi is definitely at the disadvantage still and not nah, with his leans able to hold just a better angle than Tubi was able to and he's going to clutch that round out the champs now doing the slow walk towards the building as remember they cannot sprint they are making their way over there right now and it looks like atheist actually might get some action here with Tubi who's just outside of the window and there goes that c4 Tubi with no audio he's not able to even hear that the c4 is coming and that's a great c4 kill from atheist on the Tubi your ash player going to be taken down now returns pushing in through blue now and he's just pre-firing everything because he's not sure where anyone is at but nah with a kill onto v so there goes your sludge now they still have the montane 
of Croc, who's ADSing while walking down blue stairs right now. Not going to rotate over to the blue door to try to help. And it looks like Atheist might go for a flank here as Oogie gets a kill onto Death Dealer now. Croc taking a little bit of damage, trying to get the kills here in blue. Atheist going for a flank now. Bless falling back to try to stop Oogie from pushing in through Trench. Croc watching the flank, but Bandit, Atheist, is flanking right now as we speak. And it looks like Atheist is going to take that fight somehow. Croc leaving him on about 1 HP. And oh, the 180 from Returns. He's going to get the kill onto Atheist. Atheist with a key team kill onto Nob. Nah, blessed with the kill onto Returns. A lot just happened right there. But Blessed finally getting this last kill of the round. And the gold's leading, actually, for the first time this game, 2-0. to zero. All right, looks like the golds have set up an elaborate castle strat down here in the kitchen bomb site. So we'll see if that is enough to stop the champs from pushing in. They're currently doing their slow walk towards the building. <laughs> Returns actually all the way in the building now. He's calling with Dokubi, but I'm pretty sure they don't even have any audio. So I'm not sure what that is going to do to help them right now. But nah, going to get taken out very quickly by Returns, who pushed all the way up into Mezzanine. Now, I'm not sure how nah did not get that kill. Croc now as Montaigne trying to ADS his way into the bombs right now. But he's going to have to be careful as Death Dealer on Mira is just to his left. He's going to get taken out now. Death Dealer going for two. But 2B and V going to get two kills of their own now. V going for another onto the Jaeger who's going to get taken out by Ugi. So it's all up to kicks now in the 1v4 clutch here. And he's going to get taken out by 2B. Wow, look up the line of spawn peekers here from Returns perspective. We have three, now four people all spawn peeking the same window. And Ugi is going to be the first one to get a kill and a flick on Tana for two kills. Great shots by him now, leaving Blessed and Atheist alone out here on the cliffside spawn. Plus now going to be pushing in through Big Garage as well as Atheist. But Returns is down here already ready for that. And that's going to be Atheist taken out. But remember... Returns cannot sprint away, but he can dash forwards if he needs to against this blitz. Unless Blush just ADSs for no apparent reason. And he's going to get taken out now. The champs about to clutch this round with a flawless victory. Returns the only one that's even taken damage so far on the champ team here. Kicks the last one remaining, trying to put his team in a good spot. Ugi going to hop out of the trophy window and he sees the head and there it is. That is a flawless round from the champ players. All right, here comes Blessed and Co. Trying to push in through Big Garage here, but an impact grenade from Tubi is going to damage them quite a bit. Returns actually getting the first kill here onto Nas, so that's going to be your ace being taken out now. Tubi going to fall back just a little bit to his teammates now. He does have, interestingly, the boss G, so we'll see how this goes for him. Ugi going to impact a hole above Big Garage, trying to... Stop the push in here from the gold players here. One tap actually coming out from kicks. Great shots by him onto V. That's your maestro going down. Ugi still above trying to defend against the garage push the best that he can. Window hits going to come out and he does barely not see kicks on the Zofia just outside of the window here. Atheist going to run in and get a kill. Death dealer with a kill of his own as he's in the site right now, but... He's going to get refragged by returns. Uki trying to get some shots through the floor, but they're not quite going to hit just yet. Blessed Atheist, very low HP now. Kick still doing good on HP all the way back inside of the big garage. Uki going to drop down back into the site. Probably a smart decision by him now. A minute and 30 seconds left, so all they really got to do is just watch the door. All right, Blessed on the Blitz is going to push up now, but Returns is tucked just in the corner, and I'm not sure that Blessed knows about it now. He's going to come around with the ADS, but he's not ready for Returns to be in that specific corner. Returns going to get two big kills on Atheist, and Blessed now is just up to kicks inside a big garage who has been hesitant to push up with his team, and they were punished swiftly for that. Returns on 10 kills now, trying to go for is 11th kicks only on two kills here so far the swings are coming out from kicks but it's not going to hit just yet Ugi popping off some shots returns pushing up with that bailiff kicks doesn't even seem to know about it bailiff shots go out kicks on low hp now approximately one hp but so is returns and a drop shot comes out ace from returns that's unfortunate all right the 
possibly the last round has started here the champs now on match point and not much has happened the first bullet gonna be fired from blessed here but really not much has happened so far the champs just slow walking around looking for something to do and that is about it the golds are taking a immensely long time to push in now 30 seconds and they're just now repelling up to the building none of the windows are have even been shot and we are looking at almost a minute into the round the first window is being shot open now an incredibly slow push from the gold players drones are finally going to be going in from atheist now and croc going to get a kill onto na who is just crouch walking downstairs inside of kitchen so that's going to be your Sophia being taken out now v taking quite a bit of damage inside of library croc going to come try to take his place right now but oogie quickly with a kill onto death dealer who tried to hop in through that library window bless trying to get the kill here onto croc but i'm not sure if he's going to be able to now he's taking quite a lot of damage but croc with the kill onto bless and a second onto atheist now great shots by him leaving kicks all by himself once again outside not holding an angle he's kind of baiting his teammates here returns all the way outside in campfire spawn these should be some easy kills for kicks to pick up here if he even chooses to play he's currently just afk i think the pressure has really got to he yeah he just left ggs so that's going to be the champs winning four to two on chalet i guess the pressure got to him too much and he had to just leave so respect there ggs thank you so much for watching make sure to check gfuel with the link down below in the description use my code code shock s-h-a-w-k along with that link get 30 percent off i would appreciate that thank you so much for watching like the video, subscribe if you're new, and have a great day.